Okay, so this sucks. I was just uh, cycling to go film a Community Quest video for you guys, and I pulled into a loss and checked for the item that I was looking for. Um, they didn't have it, so I left. Could have been inside for two, maybe three minutes. But when I came outside, my bicycle tire was totally flat. Luckily, I was across the street from a mall, so I'm sort of underneath the on-ramp to the parkade. So I got a bit of shade, at least. Um, I'm gonna try to repair <laughs> this puncture. Luckily, I do carry a few supplies with me, um, including bug spray, a light, safety light for when it gets dark. Of course, sun uh, screen, sunscreen, we need that. On a day like today, what else we got in here? here? We got the front light for the car, the car, the bike, <laughs> front light for the bike when it gets dark. Um, got some wet wipes, because I often eat while I'm biking around. And yes, there it is, the puncture repair kit. And of course, bicycle pump. So we should be okay to, to fix this. You saw there was just that little hole there. I think that's the culprit. I don't think it was, there was any sabotage <laughs> involved. It was just, I ran over a sharp object. It was hard to find, even though I kind of knew where it was. I could feel it on my finger, but put some water on it. There, see it? <laughs> That's it. <laughs> okay, then next what you want to do is make sure it's clean in that spot. Then take your glue. Come on, glue. <laughs> and uh, apply it here, and then wait a couple minutes. However, if your glue is old and doesn't want to come out, <laughs> you're screwed. However, I know there's a Daiso at this mall. snagged a brand new tire repair kit. This was only 100 yen, so about 70 cents at the Daiso. And I also picked up a sports drink, which is gonna taste amazing. The uh, Daiso was clear at the other end of the uh, mall. When I first entered, I was like, oh, it's so far. But then the air conditioning hit me and I was like, yes. <laughs> so I spent a bit of time in the mall, cooling down. Here we go. The new kit doesn't come in a nice little plastic box, but I can just reuse the old kit's box when I'm finished here. But it has plenty of, uh, plenty of patches. Oh, there's a big one there too. As well as a little piece of sandpaper. The, the old kit might have had that too, but it, it got lost. Some plugs, some glue, and it's got two of these uh, like inner, inner tube putting on things in metal whereas the old kit it was in plastic so there's some good things about this kit the main good thing is that the glue is not all gummed up right now first step is to find your hole which we've already found and then we can sort of clean up the area rough rough it up a bit because that helps the glue stick to it I think you want to let all the pressure out that way there's no there's nothing pushing on the glue when you put when you put the glue on. Here's the glue, so it's sealed, but luckily the cap has a little pointy thing. There we go. Put on your glue. And then I think you gotta let it rest for two to three minutes, it said, just to become become a little sort of tacky. 
Okay, so it's been about three minutes. So we got this patch here and there's some foil on one side. So it said remove, remove the foil if possible. Remove the foil and then attach the uh, patch from the foil side down. So there we go. And then it said to apply pressure. So we're gonna we're gonna hang on to this for a minute or two. Okay, so it's been about 10 minutes. So let's uh, give it a little test to see if this is gonna hold or if we gotta go back to square one. Yeah, seems seems okay, but when I was waiting for the glue to harden, I took a step outside there. It's a lot cooler just stepping outside from underneath here. There's wind. But I also noticed some thunderclouds on the way. So let's hurry up, see if we can get this back together before the rain hits us. So it seems to be nice and firm. Back tire is okay. Uh, tread, treads looked a bit worn down on the back there. So the Japanese word for a flat tire is punk. Probably short for puncture, right? So uh, yeah, we're back in business now. So let's see if we can get home before it starts raining. 